Super South Dan in Miami. Well, the show inspired a hilarious show called That Golden Girls Show. It's a puppet parody. And joining us now are the puppeteers behind the show, Ashley, Aaron, Luke, and Maggie. What up? Yeah. Yeah. This is Hello, awesome. This Hello. is awesome. Golden Girls are always... Be By the way, Golden Girls still hold up. Still so fun. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, for sure. yep. Mario, you did the Golden Girls I all those did. years ago. I was Dorothy. Where's Dorothy? Oh, right here, Mario. Right there, that's <laughs> right. Yeah. Oh, I said just like exactly. I'm looking at the, the original. You right haven't there. aged a day. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, but it was so, such a special time right there. And, and you ladies have been friends for a very long time, right? Is there any topic that's off limits? Oh, no. Our lives are an open book. <laughs> Girl life's an open blouse. <laughs> oh. And to the puppeteers, of the, which is, who is the highest maintenance puppet? Oh, well, Dorothy needs the most work, and Blanche sees the most action, and Sophia is really, really old. So oh. Oh. It's a draw. Wow. Wow. Sophia, I don't know, uh, Mario, you tell me if you're getting any of the vibes here. Oh, no. Kit Hoover dressed... I'm sorry about this, Sophia, but I did Sophia. my best. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Halloween. That's right. Y'all have to see it. Not in front of the girls. Thank you yeah. for being It was, it was all out of love, and I just love you so much. Everybody loves. What is it about the Golden Girls that is still so great? We're timeless. And I always say, if a joke's funny, who cares when you said it? <laughs> right? It's, that makes a lot of sense. All right, well, we thought, um, uh, you like, since you ladies always give the best advice, that we'd allow you to answer some questions from the audience. Is that cool? Okay. All right. Here we go. Who's first up right. with a question first for the question. ladies? Right here. Go ahead, sir. All right, so the first question is, so we got our grandma a new phone for her, for the new year, and she's just learned how to take photos, and now she's tagging me in all of her photos. What do I do with <laughs> <laughs> He's getting tagged in all his photos. What From his grandma. Like a self-portrait? Yes. Where is he taking these pictures? The beach? The discotheque? In the living you know, room. You should be glad your grandma has a life. She sounds great. That's right. I want to hang out with her. Dorothy, give me 20 bucks for a kid. Not today, Ma. <laughs> All right, next we have a question from... Who's number two? Number two. This is it. This is going great. <laughs> Hi there. Hi, my name's Alicia, and I have this guy friend, and him and I hang out quite a bit, but he hasn't made a move. Do you think I should ask him out on a date first? Did y'all hear that? There's a guy that's into her. She has, he hasn't made a move. Should she make the move and ask him out? Oh, yes, honey. You are strong and beautiful. You can do what you want. If I waited for every man to make the first move, I'd head off my Tuesday night. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. I believe we have one more question. One more question. Oh, here we go. Hi there. Hi. Um, so my husband hates to spend money. So wherever we go, he's like, is there a coupon? Is there a Groupon? Anything? So what should I do? Ladies, her husband likes the Groupon, the coupons. What does she do? Penny Pincher. Listen, in my 38 years with my ex-husband Stan, I had my share of steak dinners and my share of Happy Meals. If he's using a coupon, just make sure he uses the extra money for a decent haircut. <laughs> hey, solid advice. That's solid so advice. Great. Ladies, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much Thank for joining you so us. Much. All right, you can catch a Golden Girl show, a puppet parody of the city near you. Head over to their website for more info. We'll be right back after these messages from the local station. Y'all are good. Oh, <laughs>